Happy game day, everyone. I'm Cam, and this is Two Things with Cam. And you're probably wondering what happened to Cam's jersey. I'll tell you about that in a second. The Railers getting ready to take on the Maine Mariners at 3.05 p.m. Here are the two things you need to know heading into the opening faceoff. Thing number one, youth jersey giveaway. Well, I did fit into this youth size jersey. The first 1,000 kids, 12 and under, are going to receive this Worcester Railers youth jersey. And it's all brought to you by Pepsi Worcester. Now, yes, I'm 25 years old, and I can still fit into a youth jersey. I save a lot of money, let me tell you about that. Looking forward to seeing a lot of these jerseys out in the crowd here this afternoon. Thing number two, Jackie Avola brings us Dunkin' Donuts. Well, earlier this morning, Jackie Avola, who's right over there, Pablo, show Jackie. Hi, Jackie. Oh, thank you for the donuts. I'm going to eat a donut here and quickly tell you about last night's game. Well, the Worcester Railers fell 4-3 to three last night in overtime. I don't even like this color, but I'm going to do it. Worcester Railers fell 4-3 to three in overtime last night. They led 3 to nothing. Heading into the third period, Maine was able to score in the opening two minutes of play, and then they obviously rattled off a couple goals with under five minutes to go. Railers looking to get back in the win column here today. Wrapping up the home three and three weekend. Railers are on the road next at the Cross Insurance Arena on Wednesday, but this is a crucial game in terms of the playoff standings. We know the playoff picture. Now it's time to drop the buck, sit back and enjoy. 